the british soldiers saw her and mistaking her for the rani as she had intended them to do surrounded her they led her to their commander and see whatever she was thinking who jalgari as the plan britishers surrounded her and the britishers took her to the commander who is the commander the person who is leading the army okay the british commander okay so everybody the britishers just arrested jalgari because they were thinking that she is rani lakshmi bai and they were very happy also that finally we have conquered the fort also and finally we have conquered and we have made the rani our slave but this was not the reality we know the reality but the britishers were not knowing the soldiers who arrested rani uh, jalgari were not knowing who exactly she was okay then jalgari was presented in front of who the british commander okay the commander looked at the captive closely closely but he was not sure at all that she was the queen call dola ji at once he ordered his soldiers dola ji will know see but since he was the commander he was not so sure that the lady who has been arrested is lakshmi bai only so he told the commander sorry he told the soldiers to call who to call dola ji to sus because he was here suspecting who the british commander was suspecting because he was not sure and he was not even having a surety and he was doubtful that i don't think so she is rani lakshmi bai so he called who he called dola ji so that the dola ji could come and recognize whether she is lakshmi bai or not not see children dola ji knows who lakshmi bai was and who jalgari was but the britishers were confused okay when jalgari saw dola ji her eyes blazed with anger and she shouted you traitor you coward you shameless betrayer of your people so as soon as jalgari saw dola ji she was shocked she was shocked and she got angry why did she get angry she got angry because she was not expecting that anybody could trade or betray the motherland and dola ji did so right he betrayed his motherland just because of some money he sold his what he sold his innocence he sold his patriotism right towards his country so he sold his self he sold his soul so jalgari got angry while looking at dola ji she came to know that why exactly the britishers how exactly not why but how exactly the britishers were successful to get inside the fort because it was a secret it was a secret nobody was knowing the secret only the person who was taking care of the gate was knowing that how exactly to enter in the fort and he was the person to help the britishers to them get them inside in the fort right for what for some amount of money the englishman asked dola ji is this rani lakshmi bai it is not answered dola ji do you think it is so easy to capture the rani the commander was furious that they had been tricked he knew that if jalgari was allowed to go free she would be dangerous so she was sentenced to death by hanging now the britishers told dola ji come here recognize her please see whether she is rani lakshmi bai or now and dola ji no she is not and then he told do you really think it is so easy for you to catch rani do you really think britishers that it is so easy for you and even jalgari told her do you really think that you can fool us and you can cheat us and you can catch rani so easily it is not a easy task it is not a cup of tea and it is not such a easy task for you to catch rani but commander you know the british commander here he was curious he was sure that if you or if we let this lady free that is let jankari go that it will be very very what it will be our minus point it will be very dangerous for us because this lady is very sharp she is very active she is very furious so they sentence what death penalty for jalgari i am not afraid of dying jalgari answered proudly she said i am not afraid of dying if i want to die i will die for my country it will be a privilege it will be an honor for me to die for my country i am not at all afraid of dying as they led her to her death she shouted out to the british beware you will never conquer us we will rise again and again and fight back until we win our freedom silence they shouted but she would not be silenced as the rope tightened round her neck she cried out long live lakshmi bai long live freedom
finally what happened britishers were taking her to the place where she was to be uh, given the death penalty she was to be hanged which is there and when she went there she was trying to give what she was trying to uh, motivate others by her words that we will get our freedom we will not we will not let you conquer us we will get our freedom we will rise again and again what if i am dying 10 more girls 100 more girls like me will again rise and they will fight for our freedom that is the freedom of india while she was taken for the death right while she was taken taken for the death penalty she shouted what did she shout and she cried out long live lakshmi bai and long live our freedom so children i hope this is a very interesting story right i according to me it is a very interesting story and i hope it is also uh, it has also motivated you that we should always remain uh, trustworthy towards our country towards our motherland with this i end my chapter here and uh, till then take care and stay safe stay at your home take care of your parents obey your parents god bless you all and we will be soon meeting in the next video with the next chapter right till then take care thank you to watch